Hey, good afternoon, everybody, and welcome back to the channel. Well, I'm surveying some new solar sites for the Bungaloha today. But in order to do that, the sun has to come out, and it just now did. With all these tall trees around, it's difficult to know exactly where the sun's going to be hitting the ground. And since I am going to do ground mount, I'm running around a little bit right now. And this site is pretty good, actually, but I do plan on putting a little uh, eight foot covered kind of a porch there. So, and then if I go much further out, it's not gonna work out too good. So, gonna head to the back. So yeah, during the construction, I had this uh, canopy out there for all the cutting that needed to be done out of the rain. And I'm letting that area dry up right now. And it's been mostly overcast. And I'm not real familiar with this ground uh, where the sun hits real good. I've just never even tried to catch sun up here. But I think I found a pretty good place and I've been working on that all morning. And I moved the canopy over to here. And I'll just show you kind of what I'm working with. Now this this looks to be a pretty good area right here, but when I pitch it around to the, the east, which earlier in the, or uh, later in the year, the sun will come up here and get real high real quick and get over those trees. And right now the sun's up right there, being covered up a little bit, but, yeah, you see, it's going to have to get almost straight overhead to, to make this work. So this isn't going to be a, a very good site right here. So what I did is I came over here and I brought this Opus portable power station out here because I'm needing to still charge a few things while I'm getting this place set up. And I had to lay down a little bit of the jungle, which all looked like this real real thick but it lays down pretty good so i've been kind of smashing it down and right here a few minutes ago i was catching some really good sun and i can go back in here a little further there's no trees in my way so i can deal with all of this pretty easy just by me getting out here and walking around it tramp tramples it down pretty good and i'm just making sure that I've got, you know, good sun for this time of year because the sun is coming up now, so this should be good. And of course, right now there's clouds covering up the sun, so that 240 watt array only allowing in 15 watts, as you can see. But a few minutes ago, I saw about 170 watts, and that might be about as good as I can get, and it should get better, a little bit better every day. And then like I said, here in a couple of months, it's not going to matter because the sun here goes up straight overhead later in the year. I mean, like, up there. And it just hangs out up there all day long, and I'll have excess power. So what I'm trying to do for the array that I'm going to build here for the Bungaloha is make it workable for this time of year. So I think I'm about at the best place I can be, which is right in here somewhere. This is looking pretty good. Even if I have to go back a little bit further uh, for the lower sun days, that should be okay too. Okay, the sun is peaking out right now, 153 watts. Looks to be in full sun. And I'll show you what that looks like real quick. I can get over here without falling down. It's still a little hazardous. So right there. I mean, the sun is peeking over. It's already, this time of the year, getting over those trees. So that's going to be okay. It, it looks more like it's lower, but it's actually not. It's up right there. 
and it's just going to go right on up to this here in the next few days, next couple of weeks anyway. So I'm going to get over those trees pretty good. And I think this is going to really work because right now those panels, well, they're <laughs> the second I say it, there comes a cloud, but uh, that was in full sun. And like I said, I can jockey this around a little bit and make it work. And I do want it to be most effective for this time of the year where uh, it can be a little more challenging, but here shortly, uh, they'll just be in excess. So yeah, this is looking to be the sweet spot. I had it earlier this morning. I had it a little further over here and it was uh, catching some shadows from some of those tall trees behind me. And then I just moved it over, you know, 10 or 12 feet and boom, it came right out into the full sun. And I think I'll probably just have to back it up a few feet and that's gonna be the sweet spot. So that's where I'm gonna pop a hard array. Uh, I'm just bouncing it around with this little portable array right now so I can really get the feel of the land right here. But I'm pretty sure I can't see a better spot. I think this is gonna be it right in here. And I'll, I'll put about four or 500 watts rigid panels in there and then just run straight on in. Probably bring it right in into the corner here and uh, start setting up some solar. So that's the plan. Yeah, I did really like this area here because you can see like right now it's in some pretty, pretty darn good sun. And with that canopy, of course, peeling off all the water, it got super muddy here the last few weeks, but this will dry up quick now that the sun is coming out. And this would work, but I really don't want to block up this area. I got some plans for that, so yeah. It's gonna be better. And if I had to go, I mean, back in here would be good too, but that's a lot, lot more work to open that up. I really don't want to cut any trees down to make this happen. I always try to save all the trees because the, the trees are great, so yeah, and there it is in full sun right now. Uh, I mean, there is some clouds up there, but but that's a, that's a good spot right there. And you can see on either, on all sides around it, I got a little room to play to dial in the sweet spot. So looking good, looking good. So I am getting power using this power station and also using that uh, Licity power box. Uh, battery box that I did a review on a couple days ago and that's working well for getting everything straightened out up here so yeah pretty happy about that actually I think that's going to work so I've been kind of waiting for the sun to peek out all morning yeah. and now it's really coming out of course me trying to avoid the sun but anyway yeah looking good yeah, 180 some watts. I think that's it. Very good. All right, you guys, I'll, I'll keep showing you how things progress out here, but they're moving right along. I'll keep updating you guys how things go. Pretty pleased with everything though. All right, hope you're having a good day. Catch you later. Aloha from the bungaloha. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I like that. Getting some good sun. Very good. <sighs> Huffing and puffing. <laughs>